from Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. This is Pastor Ron with Calvary Chapel, Myrtle Beach. We're off the news right now, but really, if you look behind me, that's the news, but we haven't seen any news crews out at all. The water still is so high right now, we can't even get close to not only the intercoastal waterway that you see behind me, but behind that is the, the community of Rosewood, which is gonna be one of the hardest hit areas. Um, and so really, this is as close as we can get. This house to my left, it's still under construction from last year's storm. In 12 months, they've had two major flooding events. Would be with them, encourage them, give them wisdom and, and, and understanding working through their difficulties and that they would continue to look to you. Thank you that you are our hope and that you are Anna Marie's hope and that you just continue to watch out over them in Jesus' name. Yeah. 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 And this is the first part of the staging area you can see behind me. We've got all the a warehouse space. We just unloaded a, our first semi load of water, all kinds of soaps and different cleansers, paper towels and non perishables. And so, this is what's needed here. Uh, the church is going to be a great staging area for teams. We can have up to probably 45 or 50 people at a time staying on the property and then transporting them to various work sites, the areas that need mucking out and just need to be encouraged. We've been able to already meet with people and pray with people got some stuff out of the house. Not everything, but some. The hardwood floor all throughout had to be completely taken up. All the sheetrock in the house, every room would have to be cut up a certain distance. Get people here to help and uh, get a voice out there, let people know people still need help. And so if you have teams, if you go to, again, calvarydisasterrelief.org, if you have teams, you can send them, you can register online there. And we look forward to partnering together and seeing how God is gonna use each one of us here in the Carolinas in the midst of destruction and disaster, God is still at work. God bless you.